Good day everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix in case if your second monitor goes to sleep and won't wake up. Now, there are a couple of steps which I would suggest you to try to get this issue resolved. Now, first and foremost step, what I would suggest you to do is I would suggest you to go ahead and check or verify the cables. At times, the HDMI, DVI-D, VGA, etc. cables could cause this problem. So if you have a faulty cable and it is disconnecting randomly, you might think that your monitor is going to sleep mode. This misunderstanding could waste a lot of valuable time. That is why it is highly recommended to verify if your power cable or HDMI or VGI, VGI cables are fully functional or not so basically the first step is to check if your cables are properly connected and they are not fault in case if your cables are not faulty and if they are good the second step what I would suggest you to do is to run the troubleshooter so as sleep mode is internally linked to the power settings of your computer running the power troubleshooter could resolve this issue to run the power troubleshooter what you will have to do is you will have to click on the do the right click on the start button and then click on system once you're on the system page under the system you will have to locate for troubleshoot once you click on troubleshoot and then click on other troubleshooters navigate further down and look for power so you will have to go ahead and run the power troubleshooter once you run this troubleshooter in case if there are any uh, issues related to power settings within your computer it would try to fix the problem by itself once the power troubleshooter is completed then you can try to check if your second monitor wakes up in case if you're still facing a problem i would suggest you to try reset starting the computer and check if that works in case if that works well and good in case if that doesn't work as a next step what i would suggest you to do is i would suggest you to go ahead and check the power plan now to check the power plan what i would suggest to do is click on the search button and in the search box go ahead and type edit power plan double click on it or open the edit power plan option under this window make sure any of these settings are not set for uh, the timer so make sure it has been set to never for everything so in case if there are any in my case i had set for the correct the appropriate timings uh, in your case you will have to go ahead and check and make sure it has been set to never under this uh, and uh, once you set to ne uh, never apply save changes and check if this issue resolved in case um, if the issue resolved well and good in case if it doesn't resolve the problem the next step what i would suggest you to do is i would suggest you to go ahead and change the link state power manage to do this uh, you will have to go to uh, search for edit power plan on the same window uh, you can click on change advanced power settings once you click on change power settings you will see an option the power options under power option under uh, active power state here you will have to locate for pci express under pci express make sure the link state power management settings is being set to moderate power set so make sure under this you it has been set to moderate power set. however if the settings mentioned above is already selected you can change to turn off and apply the changes make sure both of them are off and um and then click on apply and then click on ok and check if your second monitor wakes up so after in spite of trying all the steps if you are able to if the second monitor wakes up well and good in case if you're still facing a problem then the next step what i would suggest you to do is i would suggest you to verify the company specific settings for your monitor so in case if you're if it is a dell samsung lg or any other monitor check the manual for the monitor and see if there is any uh, monitor deep sleep settings if you uh, if it's been set for your monitor so in case if it doesn't prop or uh, fix a problem try contacting your monitor manufacturer and see if there are any settings which needs to be changed in spite of trying all these steps if you're still facing a problem what I would suggest you to do is I would suggest you to leave me a comment in the comment section so that I can come up with a possible solution I hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great